Hey everyone, I'm here today with a comparing video, this time between two Beatles records, which are Beatles for Sale and Help. Now, these two records, I got them both this year. I got them, let me think, when's it, where did I get them? I got Help off of Amazon, and I got Beatles for Sale off of MerchBar.com, so that's where I got them. I got this one first, and then that, I got Help first, and then Beatles for Sale. But anyways, so right off, right off the bat there... Almost the exact same length, except this one's a little fatter because it opens up like a book, and it's one of the few records I have where it opens up like a, like a book. I'll show you. On this right here, it shows the Beatles' live performance right there at one of their concerts. I don't know what it is. Let me know in the comments below what concert they were performing at, because I don't know. And then it shows the track listing and the record right here. Which I will show you right there. And then this is one of the few records with a description inside it. It's got a description right there. Which I'll show you. Sorry if my shadow's in the way. Anyways, that's side two right there. And then there's some detailing here. And then there's a picture of the Beatles right here in front of a wall of pictures. Which is kind of cool. I've never seen a record like this. And then this is the back side of Beatles for Sale. Um, it's, it shows a picture of them out in the garden. And then the front side shows a picture of them outside, obviously. And um, for those who do not know this, um, I actually didn't know until now, but um, if you're wondering why the Beatles members look sad on the picture, well, they're not actually sad. They look sad because... Um, all four of the Beatles members in this picture are tired because because 1964 was one of the busiest years for them to tour. So they were battered out and tired, as you can see in this picture, and their hair is kind of shaggy. So that's why. So that's a little fun fact. And then on Help, it shows the picture, the Beatles spelling out the words Help with their arms. Like George Harrison spelling out H with his arms. John Lennon spelling out E with his arms. Paul McCartney spelling out L with his arms, and then Ringo Starr spelling out the P with his arms. So yeah, that's, a, that's another fun fact. And then, this is the backside of Help, I haven't showed it yet. It shows a picture of all four of the Beatles members, and then the track listing. Which side one is from the movie Help. That's side two. I apologize, my shadow's in the way. I don't know why that is, but... <laughs> Anyways, here's the rest of the detailing. That was side two I showed. And now I will show you the records. First, I gotta take them out. Alright. Right off the bat, the records are the same length, they're the same detailing, like they both got the words Parlophone on it, only difference is side one of Help says songs from the movie Help, because all those songs were played in the movie Help on side one and then for and then this is actually one of the Beatles records where the songs are from a movie the others being A Hard Day's Night Magical Mystery Tour, Yellow Submarine Let It Be, it has songs from the movie Help as well as from other albums but anyways, um, this is side one of Beatles for Sale. I'll show it. Here's side two. This is side one of Help. Oh, sorry, sorry I moved my camera there a little bit. This is Help right here. I'll show it again. That's side one. And then here's side two, which side two does not say it. these songs are from the movie Help, which means, which means I don't believe these songs were played in the movie Help on side two. But on side one, they were played in the movie Help. And then the sleeves are the same, they're both white. And that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.